Welcome back to consecutive day 1136 of a diary of a rumpreneur. And today's topic is false monetary value. So remember to give this a subscribe, share, like, and comment. As the more people we get in front of, the more money we raise on my fundraising mission to save the lives of children by attempting the ultimate ultra marathon. All the information about the challenge and how you can get involved is in the link in the comments below. Thank you as always, and let's get started. So consecutive day, 1136, the diary of a rumpreneur. And uh, today's topic is false monetary value. So the um, reason for the topic is today is one of two Amazon Prime days. So I'm pretty sure everybody out there knows what Amazon is. If you're not, it's the biggest e-commerce platform in the world. And um, ultimately, they have membership for people who um, pay a subscription fee who can get faster delivery as a perk for buying their products and services and paying a subscription. But um, they also run Amazon Prime Days once a year. I think it's usually one over a 48 hour period where they do special discounts um, for Prime members. Now, the issue with this is that it's an unbelievable marketing ploy because I am myself included, uh, sorry, myself included, as well as millions of others around the world, will look on Amazon Prime and see these special discounts based on uh, percentage off the original retail price, and um, or recommended retail price. And I think consumer law specifies that the product needs to have been listed at the, at the, at the original price for a very short period of time for it to be used as a, as a marketing tool. So you go on Amazon Prime on Prime Day and you'll see these Prime Day deals where you'll see these massive um, percentage drops in price against the RRP or recommended retail price. And um, you think, wow, I'm getting an amazing discount here. So we buy. And um, don't get me wrong, there are some, some good value deals to be had. And I like probably every other consumer tries to extract those good discounts. Um, however, if you just go just by what Amazon's discount is, um, which a lot of people do do, it, uh, it can allow you to tap into their false monetary value. And um, what I do is I always give it a quick Google price search as well, just to see that there are another retailers selling it for the similar price that Amazon are doing so. And providing it is listed significantly lower than what Google is picking up on the on the web then it, it is true value but there are lots of products on there that are either exclusive to Amazon so Amazon can kind of create their own monopolization of the price of that product or service um, and in those instances you question are you really getting a deal or is that just the price that Amazon is going to sell for anyway and they may have originally listed the product for a day at a high amount with very limited sales just to be able to use it on Prime Day as a discount percentage. So um, be wary of that, anybody who's looking at discounts and always do your due diligence on percentage discounts to ensure that you are genuinely getting value rather than it just being an exploited marketing tool, which most people will have. So the moral to the story is, yes, we all love to consume what is a perceived deal. Um, however, do your due diligence to ensure that it is a genuine discount and a genuine deal uh, versus a comparison retailers, as opposed to just taking the word of one retailer who is using a RRP recommended retail price. But remember that that price only needs to have been listed for a very short period of time for them to be able to use it as a potential promotion no discount against that value, original value. So um, do due diligence, make sure you are getting that deals. And certainly on Amazon Prime Day, there are certainly plenty of deals to be had, but there also have plenty of cons on there as well. So just be mindful of that and happy spending. So uh, that's it for me today. Any questions or comments, drop me a line or respond to everyone. Remember to give this a subscribe, share, like, and comment. As more people we get in front of, 
the more money we raise on my fundraising mission to save the lives of children by attempting the ultimate ultra marathon all the information about the challenge how you can get involved is in the link in the comments below thank you as always stay positive stay happy and i'll see you again tomorrow